All this summer, WCCO is going to the lake, and this week, Frank and Mike Max are checking out the Watson Hunting Camp, and they join us now from Watson. Great weather out there today. Beautiful. It has been just perfect all day, and Lackawanna Lake behind us is where the migration of Canadian geese comes through here and at times Frank there's as many as 150,000 geese back there which is amazing because I've hunted here and you think with 150,000 I'd be able to get one. <laughs> that hasn't happened. <laughs> Uh, Lac Quiparle, this uh, French for lake that speaks, and that comes from the geese and all the noise that they make. Absolutely. Hence a very appropriate name. Uh, it's in the city of Watson, and on the way up here to Watson, we decided to make a little detour and check out uh, some pretty interesting places, which we like to do on our road trips. Hard. Now, one of those places is this gem that you'll find between Montevideo and Granite Falls on County Road 15. It is the Swenson Farm Museum. This landmark is on the National Register of Historic Places, and the cool thing is, is you'll find it just the way it was back in the 1880s. In fact, the big red barn on the property is redone with about a half million dollar renovation. Inside the barn, though, still very simple and very open. Looks like they're getting ready for some hay. Inside, boy, what a different story. If these walls could talk of hmm. all the history they have. Now, you actually might remember this house from the independent film Sweetland. Some of it uh, was filmed here. The most well-known scenes are the table in the kitchen. That's just the beginning, though. Go upstairs, and you'll find a church. Olaf Swenson was a pastor, and he would hold his services for his neighbors and friends. And we were told when no one showed up on a Sunday that he would actually bring in some flower bags and preach to them instead. That's preaching, Maxie. Now, that's committed, Olaf. That is yeah, committed. In fact, quite, the, quite a pastor. The, the Swensons are so committed to this that they want to bring you out each and every year in the fall and show you what life was like back in the day on the farm. So they do that with what they call the horsepower event. This year will be September 13th out here. You can look it up on our website, WCCO.com, for all the details. And if you can't make that, they have tours every Sunday. And if you can't make that Sunday tour, if you call ahead, you might be able to arrange for a special place, and that's on the website as well. So pretty cool gem that we found up on the way here, and we have a lot more for you from Watson coming up, ladies. Oh, we can't wait. We'll see you in a few minutes. Thank you.